Hello, this is MakerJ101, and here's a little wind turbine I made. Um, I made this probably when I was about 12. Um, that would have been 2007, so, yeah, a little while ago. Um, but it's, it's about, um, oh, two feet high, two and a half feet high, I'd say. Um, and it's just got these um, cups that I made here out of aluminum, um, sheet aluminum, and um, some plywood, and some other scraps of lumber. Um, but it works okay, but I mean... I was hoping when I built this that I'd be able to maybe get like a few watts enough to power a small light bulb or something out of it. But I mean, there's there's no way unless you had 50 mile an hour gusts of wind. I mean, right, probably today we're getting 30 to 40 mile an hour gusts. And I mean, it's spinning pretty good right now. It would be enough to light up a couple of LEDs with an efficient generator on it. And I had a generator on here, um, but I took it off because I didn't want it to get all rusty. I mean, I tested it out for a little while and it would um, turn on a little tiny bit when you get really strong gusts of wind and it'd be blowing like when it'd be spinning like that But that's about it. I mean wind just doesn't have um, It's just not a lot of energy in wind. you have to have a huge wind turbine in order to get any power out of it Because it just doesn't have much mass it just I mean it ha might have large velocity But the amount of energy that is actually in the wind is not really that significant so I mean Something like this is really not going to produce very much power. You have to have something huge. Um, but I made do with materials I had, like this sheet aluminum. It was only that wide. And I um, sort of makeshift riveted it together. I took a took the sheets of aluminum and overlapped them about half an inch there. And then I would t I put it on a board and hammered a nail through it a little bit, a large nail. And then bent the pieces over and whacked it flat. Then I put some aluminum tape over it, which I probably really didn't need to do, but I did that back then, so I thought I needed to do it back then, but yeah, now I'm kind of looking back on it and saying, why did I put aluminum tape on there? What a waste. But um, down here I just have the bearing is a um, like a light fixture bracket with, with lead solder in the middle there. Melted lead solder in the middle and then drilled it out a little bit, and the point of the shaft sits on that. It works pretty good. It hasn't worn out yet. There used to be oil in it, but that all came out because it's been sitting out in the weather for so many years. Um, gear kind of comes loose up here for the top bearing, but um, so yeah, and it fell off our deck a few times. That's why it used to be up on our deck, but now it's down here sitting on the wall, but that's why it's kind of cracked there. So, so yeah, I just thought I'd show you guys my little wind turbine I, built, I put together a while ago. Um, that's about it. Thanks for watching.